Hello, my name is Erwin Gonzalez and I'm a fitness professional. I'm also the creator of the Kinetic Sculpt Method of Movement and Fitness. I'm here at the New York Health and Racquet Club and this video, what I want to talk to you about is how to create an exercise routine chart. Now, what's, why charting is important is you want to be able to measure and monitor your routines so that you can see that you're becoming successful and more importantly, at the end of six to eight weeks, you actually can see the reward. And why work out if there's no reward, right? The first step in creating a chart is I want you to invest in a way to journal these exercises and chart them. Now, you can do it on paper because I'm a paper guy. I love writing, so writing for me works. If an Excel spreadsheet is your medium, use an Excel spreadsheet. You can also go online if you want and find an app where you can record your chart in and do whatever works for you and don't be afraid to experiment. Now, the next step is you want to define your goals. There are many goals to training. You can have a strength goal. You can have a mass goal. You want to get bigger. You can have a weight loss goal. You can have an endurance goal. Let's say you're injured and you're returning to exercise. You want to get strong again. That's a goal. You also can have your doctor who finally said, hey, you know what? Party's over. You need to start exercising. So if that's also a goal, create your training around the goals. Now, once you have your goals, then you move into the next step, which is exercise selection. You pick the exercises to help you meet your goals. Okay, it's pretty straightforward. After you know your exercise, you go into the weight. You have to experiment to know what's the good weight to start with. All right, so play with it, see what's a good weight to start with, and then you're gonna move into the next thing, repetition. How many reps of these weights you want to do? Now, that is again goal-oriented. A strength set, an endurance set, have a different number of repetitions. So you want to make sure that that is in line with your goals. So once you've figured out those things, we're gonna to move to our next step, which is schedule. Most people are unsuccessful with exercise because they're not realistic with how much time they have. Don't pick a five-day routine when it's a pie-in-the-sky dream. You want to pick a, a routine and a, that you can stick with. Be conservative at first. If you love it, I promise you'll change your life and your life will change around it and you'll get more. Start with two to three days and easy suggestion, here's an example. Let's say I do all my upper body in one day, I can do lower body on another day. That's two days. On the third day, I'll repeat upper body. The next, and now call that week A. The next week will be week B. I'll do two days of lower body and one day of upper body. That's week B. Keep alternating that. Cycle it for six to eight weeks. Always make sure it's even, not five or seven weeks, right? Six to eight weeks. Always make sure it's even. Add core training to every workout. And try to also squeeze in your cardio. So look at your time. One workout may be 90 minutes. One workout you only have 40 minutes. Look at your time. Base your workouts around, again, realistic time frames. You have to get real if you want real results, okay? The next step is going to be measure, to measure and monitor, measure and monitor. You must be recording these things down. And I know it may feel awkward in the very beginning, but I promise you that's where the, all, the, all the reward is, all the juice, all the gravy, all the celebration at the end. If you're not recording it, we don't know if you got stronger, and we want to know that. You may also want to record your weight, and I know weight makes people nervous, but it's a real number. Be real with it. You can be 165 pounds and have a 30-inch waist, and you can be 165 pounds and have a 36-inch waist right? It, muscle weighs more than fat, okay? So keep that in mind. Keep it realistic. And I promise, I know I gave you a lot of information, but I promise if you stick with it, it will work. You're going to be successful. You will exercise consciously. You will feel better. And more importantly, you're going to mail me a check because I just changed your life. <laughs> and having said that, I'm Rowan Gonzalez, and take care. Have a great day.